Hi there, my name is Scott Jameson. I'm a GP in Tayside in Scotland and I'm the RCGP Scotland Executive Officer for Quality Improvement. I'd like to talk to you today about quality improvement reports that we receive in practices. There are now quality improvement reports which are being produced in a collaborative by the RCGP and the Clinical Practice Research Data Link, known as CPRD. They are part of the MHRA. The reports produced are sent to practices two or three times a year and are available to all practices in the CPRD network, which covers all four nations of the UK. The reports give information at a practice level. For each indicator, it gives a benchmark against peers across the UK and an ability to identify the patients involved at a practice level using pseudo-anonymised data, which is searchable in your practice. There are currently four indicators in the CPRD reports. These include pioglutazones and non inflammatory drugs prescribed to patients with heart failure. Also, non inflammatory drugs prescribed to patients with CKD and patients prescribed aspirin as monotherapy for treatment of atrial fibrillation. There are two new indicators to come in the newest iteration of reports being released later this year. The reports are confidential. You don't need to share them with anyone, but you can choose to do so within your practice clusters or within collaborative networks locally in your area. The reports are intended to be supportive. It's not about performance management, they are there to complement quality improvement within your practice. The data comes from the CPRD database and to gain access, the practice simply needs to sign up online to this service. The practice data is used anonymously for monitoring of safety and effectiveness of prescribed drugs as well as for public health research, which is all supported by the UK government. Personally, I feel that these, these reports have been very complementary to quality improvement work within our practice. They come in manageable ch chapters, which let us review each individual indicator in order to make sure that the prescribing we are doing in our practice is of highest quality. I do think they're worthwhile doing, and I would encourage you to sign up at cprd.com. Thank you.